If you're looking for ways to eliminate corns and calluses on your feet, this video is for you. We will show you how to treat these common foot problems at home using simple household items. So watch and learn how to keep your feet feeling smooth and soft. So here are the best ways to treat calluses and corns on the feet. 1. Soak the affected area in warm water for 10 to 15 minutes. This soak will help soften the callus or corn, making it easier to remove. You can also use a pumice stone or files to slough off the dead skin. Be sure to moisturize your feet afterward to prevent the callus or corn from reforming. 2. File the corn or callus using a pumice stone. A pumice stone can be a helpful tool in treating calluses and corn on your feet. First, soak your feet in warm water for 10 to 15 minutes to soften the skin, as per method number 1. Then, gently rub the pumice stone over the callus or corn in a circular motion. Please, do this carefully to prevent irritation or damage to healthy skin. After a few minutes of rubbing, rinse your feet with cool water and apply a moisturizer. Repeat this process every day until the callus or corn disappears. 3. Apply a moisturizer or lotion to the area. If you have calluses or corn on your feet, you can treat them at home with a moisturizer or lotion. Many products are available, so you can find one that suits your needs. Read the instructions carefully before applying any product to your skin. It is crucial to clean the area well before applying a moisturizer or lotion. This precaution will help the product work more effectively and prevent further irritation. Gently massage the product into the affected area using circular motions. You may need to apply the product several times a day, depending on the severity of your condition. If you have diabetes or other health conditions that cause circulation problems, it is crucial to check with your doctor before using any home treatment for calluses or corn on your feet. 4. Use paddings. Padding is an excellent option for corn and calluses. You can buy these special pads or moleskin at a drugstore. You can also use a soft cloth or cotton ball to help cushion the area. Padding has many advantages when treating calluses and corn on feet. For one, Padding can help provide cushioning and support for the foot, relieving pain and discomfort. Additionally, padding can help protect the skin from further friction, irritation, and injury. Finally, padding can also help to absorb moisture and keep the feet dry, preventing the growth of bacteria and fungus. 5. Wear perfect fitting shoes. Wearing shoes that fit perfectly is one of the most effective ways to prevent calluses and corns on your feet. Calluses and corns result from friction and pressure on the skin, so if your shoes are too tight or too loose, they can rub against your feet and cause these problems. Make sure to measure your feet before buying new shoes, and always try them on before you buy them to make sure they fit well. Depending on the shoe brand, you may need to buy a size up or down. If you have any problems with calluses or corn, talk to your doctor about how to treat them. 6. Trim your toenails regularly. If you have ever had a corn or callus on your foot, you know how painful they can be. You may not know that long toenails can facilitate the development of these painful conditions. Here is how, when your toenails are too long, they can put pressure on the toe when walking or running. This pressure can cause friction between your feet and shoes, thickening and forming a callus. Long toenails can also lead to corn formation. 7. Apply salicylic acid. You can treat corn and calluses at home with salicylic acid. Salicylic acid is keratolytic, breaking down the tough outer skin layer. This quality can help reduce the thickness of calluses and make them easier to remove. Soak your feet in warm water for 10 minutes to soften the skin. Then, apply the acid to the calluses or corn with a cotton swab or cotton ball. Allow it to dry for 5 minutes then wash it off with warm water. You can do this once or twice a day until the calluses or corn are gone. 8. Apply castor oil. Doctors often recommend castor oil as a natural remedy for corn and calluses. This oil can soften the hard skin and peel it off. Massage the affected area with castor oil until it is completely absorbed. 
Repeat this process daily until the callus, or corn softens and eventually falls off. While castor oil is generally considered safe, it can cause skin irritation in some people. If you experience redness, itching, or burning after using castor oil, discontinue use immediately and consult your doctor. 9. Use Epsom salt foot soak. Try an Epsom salt foot soak if you need a simple and effective way to treat calluses and corn on your feet. Add a cup of Epsom salt to a basin of warm water and soak your feet for 15 minutes. The Epsom salt will help to soften the hard, rough skin on your feet, making it easier to remove with a pumice stone or callus file. 10. Apply baking soda paste. You can remove corns and calluses at home using baking soda. Baking soda works by exfoliating the dead skin on your feet and revealing the healthy skin beneath. Mix one or two tablespoons of baking soda with enough water to form a paste. Apply the paste to your feet and massage it to the affected areas for 20 minutes. Then, rinse your feet with warm water and pat them dry. Repeat this process once or twice a week until the calluses or corn disappears. As you can see, corns and calluses can be painful and unsightly. However, there are a few things you can do at home to get rid of them. Soak your feet in warm water for 15 minutes, then use a pumice stone to rub the corn or callus. Apply a corn or callus plaster before bed, and wear paddings and comfortable shoes that fit well. With these simple tips and proper treatment, you can say goodbye to those pesky corn and calluses for good. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to Natural Health Remedies, and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on 14 proven home remedies for corns and callus removal that work. Thanks for watching and bye for now.